Hey guys, I'm Suleiman Khan and in this video, we will be importing PDF file into AutoCAD. For this approach, I'll be using AutoCAD 2017 because an import option may not be available in the previous versions. You can say in the older versions, maybe in 2007, 2006, in those versions, okay? And I'll be using an example of a road section. You can say this is a PDF file. I have this one, okay, which is a simple road section having 25 feet as carriageway. Okay, I'm going to cross it and I'm going to jump into my AutoCAD. Here, AutoCAD provides different, you can say, places, okay, to import that PDF file. You can say you can click in the file and there is, uh, you can say, import option and then you can click PDF. Another way is to uh, click on insert and then click on attach. There is another option. You can just, if you look to the import panel, there is of course PDF import. You can also type import in the command bar and then press enter. AutoCAD brings the same dialog box, okay, import file. You can navigate to your file. As you can see this time I have date on the desktop and that is road section. I'm going to click date and then click open. As you can see another dialog box appeared. You can change different options for the drawing. I'm not happy to deal with these guys this time. Okay, you can also change these things, but by default, I'm happy with that. So I'm going to click OK. As you can see, AutoCAD is just converting the elements of that PDF, okay, into DWG, you can say. So it's going to take few seconds. We're going to wait for that. And uh, uh, bam, that's done, okay. As you can see, this is the same section. You can also confirm it. Let me just confirm it from the uh, annotate and then dimensions. I'm going to click this corner and another corner just to confirm the carriageway. As you can see, this is 25, okay? That's, that's pretty good, okay, and very easy. You can do it just in few seconds to import, okay? All right, there can be another problem, okay? When you import the PDF file from any other versions, okay, depending on the plot and printing and depending on the scale, it can happen to you that uh, what as you can see i'm going to if i check this one just a minute as you can see the carriageway this time it is just five feet okay because it's been scaled you can just align it and scale it to the 25 feet okay how you gonna do it for this approach you are going to uh, create or draw a line having length equals 25 feet and then align it okay like you can select this section and then type al in the command bar okay press enter it's gonna ask to specify the first source point so i'm going to align this point with that point and the other corner of the carriageway to the other side of the or you can say the other end of the line I'm going to press enter or space. Now AutoCAD is asking if you wanna uh, scale these objects based on the alignment specified, okay? I'm happy to scale it. So I'm going to click yes, or I can also type Y in the command bar. So I'm going to click yes, and that's been done. You can now confirm it, okay? I'm going to click this point and another point, which is this one. And of course that's been done okay it's 25 feet now so this is how we can just import any pdf file into AutoCAD. hey if you like these types of videos please hit that subscribe button press the bell icon so you never miss an update from an engineer boy